Um, thank you for coming to the uh, ECOR 21 workshop on the Curious Robots. Um, good morning uh, to East Coast people. Good, very early morning, West Coast. Uh, good afternoon to Europe and good evening to Asia. Um, welcome. Um, I'm Soshi Iba from Honda Research Institute USA. We're co-hosting this uh, event with Henny Benamore from ASU, Josh Tannenbaum from P MIT, Chris Mavrogenis from UDAF, and David Ezel from Honda Research Institute USA. Uh, we'll take you through this uh, workshop today. So let's uh, kind of like uh, get to the motivation. Um, so we're dealing with curiosity, uh, a fundamental mode of cognition. I leave it as a question mark because, uh, well, we want to question that later in the panel discussion. But uh, we think of curiosity as a following, like a desire for, whoa, the lighting goes so, oh, whoa, what is going on? Okay, sorry. <laughs> Uh, this desire for learning and knowledge uh, through sometimes unnecessary actions. Um, it could be unnecessary uh, depending on what kind of long horizon you're looking at. This behavior could be goal-directed in the long run. Uh, then curiosity could be a source of exploration and discovery, uh, could give opportunities for trials and unexpected outcomes. Um, of course, um, curiosity could be a desire to observe and understand negotiation between others and enables to model interactions, not just between human and human, but uh, object to human and object to objects. And below is very crude uh, illustration of what could be going on uh, from, for a child to become a craft, craftsman. So they first get taught uh, by parent, uh, then try yourself, learn from observation, explore on yourself, acquire and cogitate and devise, and then you become a person who could discover and apply. And such capability we would like to apply to robot, of course. Uh, so building a curious robot, would this be a breakthrough in AI? Uh, we don't know, uh, but curiosity could be a part of the breakthrough. However, um, we find this term curiosity in many different domains, uh, in robot learning, computer vision, uh, task and motion planning, human robot interaction, psychology, child development, uh, cognitive science, which uh, tends to appear very independently. Uh, and uh, we do feel that there's a need for better understanding of this phenomenon at a broader scale. So I think we should really collaborate uh, on a diverse set of research fields. Uh, that is why we are uh, organizing this workshop. Uh, in this line of uh, doing a diverse uh, collaboration, um, me as in Honda Research Institute has been doing something like that. Uh, we have been uh, running this curious minded machine network of excellence between different universities on various fields. Uh, where curious minded machines defined as a robot or intelligent system that learns continuously in human like curiosity driven way. Um, today, um, the committee uh, is um, mostly part of this curious minded machine network, and there are going to be many talks from the people who are involved in this uh, curious minded machine uh, project. Uh, so I would like to put it up here and uh, out. Uh, like to hear a uh, good talk from uh, PIs. Um, today, uh, invited talk uh, start from 9.15, uh, which is 10 minutes from now. Uh, first by uh, Dr. Uh, Pierre-Yves Odier, and then from left to right, uh, we'll hear uh, from uh, Dr. Nick Roy from MIT, then Dr. Kostas Danilidis uh, from UPenn, then Dr. Sri, uh, Sid Srinivasa from UDAF, and then uh, Dr. Leila Takayama from UC uh, Santa Cruz. Various topics. Um, in the afternoon, we will have a panel discussion uh, with the uh, following panelists, uh, moderated by Henny. Uh, we will ask questions uh, such as, is curiosity really a fundamental mode of cognition? Or what is the role of curiosity? And uh, now it is really a hot topic. Uh, why do we need it now? Like, why is it coming up? 
uh, is this a breakthrough to AI or what are we looking for and more. So please look forward to the panel discussion also. Um, we'll have a spotlight and poster sessions uh, twice during the day. Uh, we have seven papers per session. Uh, during the spotlight session, uh, we will have uh, three minute uh, lightning talks from each of the papers and uh, one minute Q&A in between. Um, then after this uh, 30 minutes of spotlight session, we'll have a poster session where we will break into the different rooms. So we will use the Zoom breakout rooms for each posters where the each presenters will be the co-host of the room. So uh, to the presenters, uh, you will be the owner of the room. So uh, please use it, share your screen. Um, and please uh, run a good discussion inside this breakout groups. Similar to the post session one, post session twos happen as uh, slightly later, uh, also by seven uh, authors. And similarly, we will be using the Zoom breakout rooms for each process, and the presenter will be the co host. Okay. Actually, I'm going very quickly. So, actually, this is the uh, final slide uh, of uh, my introduction. So, um, I would like to note to everyone that uh, this is a virtual uh, workshop, everything happens on Zoom and uh, all the workshop uh, will be recorded um, for the uh, talks and the poster sessions alike uh, please ask questions on chat or use this raise hand feature of zoom uh, so that during the q and a session the host can actually release your uh, lock to your uh, uh, camera and the mute and uh, this schedule and papers are also available on the website. Well, that is basically how you came into the Zoom, but uh, you can go back to the uh, web page for the information and also there are papers available uh, on the web page. Um, so now uh, we are 9, 10 um, in the introduction. Um, we will uh, first uh, start with a talk by Dr. Pierre Yusodier, uh, going to the talk by then Nick Roy. Uh, we'll have a slight break, then a talk by Professor Costas Danilidis. Then we'll go into this uh, poster session, spotlight and poster. After the break, there will be a talk by uh, Professor Sid Sinipasa. Then we'll have another set of spotlight and poster session. Then uh, we'll have a talk by Professor Leda Takayama. Um, then uh, the last event uh, for today will be the panel discussion uh, by Professor Tenenbaum, uh, Professor Roy, Professor Takayama, and Professor Danidis. And then at the last, uh, at last, uh, at the closing, uh, we will be announcing the uh, winner of the best poster award, where we'll be uh, presenting. Uh, GPU as a sign of uh, appreciation uh, to the uh, best uh, scientific uh, contribution to this area of uh, curiosity and curious robots.